You see that? Oh. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Where's the... Huh? I don't see him. He's not. Yes, yes, I haven't got all day. Yes, yes. At some point we should hire Tekla on here. If she yes. could just spend less time serving Dengue. Marcus, ah, I wish where I are you? you both, Nari. I really do. Make it quick. You see those warriors from Hammerhead? They've got curved swords. I'm blind. Swords. Yeah? Nari. Need something? Welcome to Dead Man's Drink. Uh, let's wait. Welcome to Dead Man's Drink. Strangers like you bring war. I've seen enough war. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hmm? Make it quick. Right, These graves hold the sons and daughters of Falkreath. You want something from me? Yes. <laughs> oh, gentlemen. Depends. Are you thirsty? Hungry? Both? Oh God. We could Hungry. Be fighting, taking back Nordland. Uh. Thank you. Enough. Hmm. Hmm. I want. Make it quick. You have the look of a killer. Oh. Ah, uh, let's eat. Um, meat pie. Let's drink. Till the war Make it quick. Yes. Uh, oh my God! Oh my God! Stop right there! Oh my God! I. I'm. No, no, no! I. I gonna yes yes I gonna load that because I don't like uh, steel stuff. Oh, uh, let's see the general. Uh, find my Marcus in that man's drink in Falkreat. Yeah, I'm here. Is and drink? where is Marcus? Oh, uh, up there, maybe. Oh, look at that. Door expert. Where? I oh, hello, Marcus. Words. It's bad for Skyrim. Oh, bless the divines, you came. Yeah. Well met. And welcome. We have much to discuss. Yes. Will you tell me, what happened at Helgen? At some point we should hire Tekla on here. If she could just spend the um, time serving Dengir. Ah, I almost both, got really my cool. head cut off. Um, you already know Helgen was attacked by a dragon have you. Uh, let's, uh, let's um, say well, this. No, now that you mention it. Okay. Then it's as I feared. My brother and his family are lost. Mm. Gods damn it all. I'd hoped for better news. Okay. Yes, I've heard the fort is full of them. But appearances can also be deceiving. If I'm right, these are no bandits at all. I have it on good authority there is a man known only as Val. Inside the keep. Falkreath is a fine place to be. Both. He's the leader of a small group of mercenaries, for yeah. lack of a better term. Could be fighting. Their and aim is to kill Thalmor wherever they're found. A place where we have good that they've come out of hiding is beyond mysterious. The war comes they're insurrectionists. A resistance movement, if you will. His name is Valerius Tiberius Artoria. Oh. We served for many years together in the Imperial Legion, as captains under Titus Mead II during the Great War. He was a good man in those days, an honorable man. Then the Aldmeri invaded, 
and murdered his wife, son, and daughter in cold blood. Uh... They marched them down the streets of the Imperial City and tortured them until they were dead. Right in front of the Imperial Palace itself. They said, Let it be known that any family members of Imperial officers found anywhere else in the province would receive a similar fate. There were many such atrocities committed by those wretched maggots within those walls. Oh, and even more unspeakable tragedies in the rest of Cyrodiil. We were under orders to flee the city for Skyrim when they invaded. We left our people, our families, defenseless. Most did not survive. But then he went quiet, did the few that did make it out of there were scattered as refugees throughout the rest of the province. The plan was to regroup here in Skyrim, rest and resupply our forces, and return to the Imperial City to retake it. That took almost a year. Surely you know the history. If not, this book will help you understand a little of what we went through. Uh, okay, when we what finally returned to the city, there wasn't much left. We split our forces, and I led the charge from the southern waterfront district, while Valerius attacked from the west. March right down to the main gate and knock on the door, he said. The man had guts, that's for sure. After we retook the city, he started to change. He knew his family was gone, but when he learned that they were tortured in the streets, he went mad and vowed to avenge their deaths. He started conducting covert operations that were unknown even to me, his closest friend. He took a handful of his most loyal men and began assassinating Aldmeri officers and diplomats, wherever he could find them. Of course, all of this was without knowledge or consent from our commanders. When they were caught, well, let's just say justice was swift. But the Aldmeri feared making a martyr out of him, as they knew the people were aware of his family's torture and murder. Uh, okay. No, but under pressure from the Thalmor, Titus locked him and his men away in the Imperial prison for the rest of their lives. Soon after, I decided my service had come to its end and retired from the Legion. But you don't get to be a captain and not accumulate a few favors. Uh, well, yes and no. I wasn't actually involved in the operation, but a young lieutenant who served under me was stationed there after I retired. And he found an ancient passage out of the prison that had long been forgotten about. We always heard the stories about it from ages ago. But none of us believed they were true, and dismissed them as fairy tales. But they were true, and Lieutenant Buckingsley found the passage. So, on a dark and stormy night, Buckingsley quietly slipped a key into Valerius's cell, and created a diversion, which bought Val enough time to escape. Let's they see. went straight away to Hammerfell to join the Red Guard Rebellion against the Aldmeri Dominion. It was rumored a secret brotherhood who called itself the Keepers of Hatu was formed after the signing of the Second Treaty of Stros Mackay. Most people passed these rumors off as baseless gossip, but the name Hatu always had intrigued me. Hatu was the mountain where the Red Guard hero Frandar Hunding and his sword singers made their final stand against the armies of Hera. It was a bloody battle in their history, but their victory led them to a new land they named Hammerfell, which began the modern day Red Guard society. Okay. Here, I brought a few of my old books along just to refresh my memory. Perhaps you'd like to study them if you're interested in history. You may read them at your leisure. And tell me. I need you to go try and talk to Valerius. Yeah. Reason with him. Tell him Marcus Janus requests a meeting with him. 
Tell him I'll come to the fort alone. Present company excluded, of course. Give this ring to him. It was his wife's wedding band. If any of his men try to accost you, show it to them and tell them it is a gesture of goodwill from me. Hmm. They'll give you quarter if they know I sent you. Approach the guards and show them the ring. Tell them Marcus Janus sent you to see Valerius Tiberius Artoria on urgent business. Show them this note with my seal, but tell them it's for Valerius, his eyes only. Please return to me as soon as you can. I'll prepare to leave and be ready to go when you return. Make haste, young man, and may fortune favor the foolish. Yes. Okay. Oh, hello. Need something? Uh... Need something? I need a fresh air. Um, uh, well, let's see. situation I've tried how I won't convince you to convince you to you my sincere consent mm -hmm. This is nice letter for a friend. Red guards, mm, the Great War. Much of that is writing in this book is pieced together from document documents captured from the enemy during the war Interrog interrogation of prisoners and eyewitness accounts from surviving soldiers and imperial officers m uh, I myself commanded the 8th legion in Hammerfell and Cyrodiil until I was wounded in 175 during the assault on the imperial city that sa said that say, sa said oh what's going on with me uh, the full truth of some events might never be known I have done my best to fill in the gaps with educate, educated conjurists no oh mine based it on my experience as well as my hard earned knowledge of the enemy. Okay, um, um, uh, that's 
that's not a good way. Um, Look at them. Little Khajiits. How can I assist? Hmm? Uh, right now you can. Uh, let's see your name and your nowhere. nowhere. This one needs something. Uh, I can't wait to find the cardro. Khajiit cardro. I like him. He's nice. And uh, now I need to go to Helgen. And uh, give that uh, letter for wa Val. And I have uh, another business in Helgen. Great. So it's a long way. Uh, let's save this. Yeah, here actually. Uh, what's this? What I found, I can see. I found. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Um. Yes. Tower. Okay. Oh. Garnet gold. Oh. Nice. I don't need war eggs. Um Let's try new boots. Mm. Oh, I forgot to sell this one. Yeah. Increase fire resistance by 15%. Okay. Um, let's go. Mountain on um, this way, I can't do anything. So let's go. Oh, now I need to save again. Oh, this is... Aerial 